all hail the king! The following contest is a fatal four-way tag team match. And it's for the WWE Tag Team Championship. Introducing first, from Memphis, Tennessee, weighing in at 235 pounds, Jerry the King Lawler. Can you believe that Jerry Lawler has been competing in the ring for over 50 years. Yeah, it's absolutely incredible. The King has been a master in the ring and at the commentary table. And even after all those years, King still has tricks up his sleeve and under his crown. Maybe you can borrow his crown to cover that bald spot. What are you talking about, Corey? 50 years in the ring and the King still has better hair than you. That's debatable. Dozens of championships won in Memphis before he joined WWE. He is certainly one of the all-time greats. Hey, King. The flying fist drop. It was actually an honor of mine, Corey, to be able to have uh, been hit in the mouth by the flying fist drop at one point in my career. Well, the King looks ready to deliver a royal beating. Maybe to you again, Michael. And his partner, maybe to Corey, from Lime, Florida, 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 weighing in oh, at 270 pounds, Titus O'Neal. Well, if you talk to Titus O'Neal, he'll tell you one of his proudest achievements or what he's done for his community. Yeah, but what Titus has achieved in ring is no joke either. Former WWE Tag Team Champion and the first ever 24-7 Champion. Nobody can question Titus's abilities, but can it translate into sustained in-ring success? Given his work ethic, no reason it can't. Grand Metalik is here. And representing Lucha House Party from Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico, weighing in at 175 pounds. Grand uh, Get ready for some oohs, gentlemen. Get ready for some ahs. Well, thank God he's wearing that mask because instead of oohs and ahs, we get a lot of ohs. Speak for yourself. Grand Metal League's held titles around the world, almost as many titles as mirrors he's shattered. From Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens! I think it's fair to say that Kevin Owens doesn't care about anybody but himself. Why should Kevin Owens care about anybody but himself? Nobody's helped KO. Nobody led KO to the promised land. He did it all by himself. a universal champion, a United States champion. The list goes on and on, and Kevin Owens owes it all to himself. You know who he is, but you don't know why he's here. Well, he's probably here for a fight. And representing the NWO from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 280 pounds, Scott Hall! Call it what you want, call it the razor's edge, call it the outsider's edge. His opponents simply know it as the end. Indeed, no matter the name, you know it's gonna hurt.
Byron, why don't you go up there and interview Scott Hall and talk to him about his toothpick? Um, I'm needed here. No, you're not, I promise. Well, the disciple has arrived. One of the most dynamic athletes in WWE, now under the learning tree of the Messiah. And from Melbourne, Australia, weighing in at 213 pounds, Murphy! In the early parts of Murphy's career, he found success winning the NXT Tag Team Championship and Cruiserweight titles, but in the years since, lost direction until the Messiah. Made a huge difference in Murphy's career has the Messiah. Formerly known as the best kept secret, Murphy now a proud and willing prophet, spreading the word of the Messiah, Seth Rollins. Murphy is a completely changed man. is here and the demon Finn Balor Finn Balor will always be known as the first ever WWE Universal Champion after an incredible match with Seth Rollins at SummerSlam Finn Balor forced to relinquish the title the next day due to injury but Finn Balor continues to grow his legend here in WWE Finn Balor only brings out the demon when it's time for a big fight. That is a sight to behold. Intimidating. Exciting. Extraordinary. Well, the Messiah has arrived. It is time 
to embrace the vision. And from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds, Seth Rollins! A multiple time WWE Champion and countless other singles and tag Let's team titles go! in addition to Money in the Bank and winning the Royal Rumble. Yeah, but Saxton, now Rollins has a much higher calling, an even greater yeah! purpose. Well, that's what he would have you believe. I think it's all just a ruse to sneak his way into the main event, personally. Well, the opposition, I guess, needs to embrace the vision. Well, they'd be wise to embrace the vision. Should they choose not to, the opposition will be embracing a beating. Multiple teams facing off in this Tornado Tag match. In a Tornado Tag situation, you never know how many opponents will be targeting you. The only one on your side is your tag team partner. Just breaking down the opponent. Someone's willing to go to destroy another human being. And by chilling, I mean beautiful. Oh, perfect kick. Great reversal. Oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. Jarring impact. Vicious kicks to the jaw. Oh, man. Face buster. Now, trample the opposition. He'll head to the ring. Struggling a bit here. A tag match like this is a test of endurance in every aspect of the world. Earl away. God. Definitely not where you want to be right now. Just carry it like a ragdoll here. Oh, no, 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 no. Chicken wing hoisted up. And flip right to the belly. The arm getting pulled. Murphy's attack gets reversed. I think we know what's coming next. Superstar showing great awareness of their opponent's repertoire. A drop kick. He's got a record of Watson. Okay. This has been granted. Will Hall seal the deal? Oh, elbow drop for Abbott Mezzer. Chuck Slam. Kevin Owens. Stop this being eliminated. The hook of Hawks. Dead with gut wrench suplex. Just punch him in the chest. What a gut wrench power Oh, what a flying knee kick. Just like that, Natalie finds a counter. There's some power behind that punch. Cinches up the arm and it. Slip away! Big overhand.
seize the moment. Now's the time to keep the pressure on. Dropping the elbow right on the knee. Good technique for Mercy. Elbow finds its mark. He may be in a bad way here. It's impressive to have some stamina left this deep into the match, but even that can't last forever. Jumping elbow drop. Hulk dodges out of that. Hanging back with their own count. Sequence of reverses there. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. Oof, that can knock you out. Down in a hurry. Schoolboy pin combination. Oh, maybe not. First up time. Nobody home. Oh, he wins. That's going to hurt. Oh, man, that was nasty. They weren't that good looking anyway. Carefully measured. Again? Right in the head. 
Hoist it up. Murphy reverses. And this might not have a pleasant ending. And the fireman's carry. Coming back in the ring. He gets back into the... He turns it around. Tough position to be caught in here. Look out! their championship dream has become reality. Honestly, Michael, there is no way I can think to describe this other than absolute goosebumps. Then imagine how the new champ must feel, Byron.